Good morning, Alexis Love Beauties and Flawless Man. Reading from our daily bread in Titus chapter 3, verses 1 through 2. Put them in mind to be subject to principalities and powers, to obey magistrates, to be ready to every good work, to speak evil of no man, to be no borrowers, but gentle, sowing all meekness unto all men. What more can I say, dear God, than I've said before my beloved newly adult child was born. Watch over and visit this young person with your presence. We've done a pretty good job so far, and I, you and I, and now it's time to let go. Be with me. I am better at roots than wings. Remind me that nothing can separate us from one another or your love. Help me to be there for my children as you are for me companion God um, go with this child today I mustn't follow too closely and I can't yet judge my distance so the saying from Titus chapter 3 verses 1 through 2 is saying how it sounds like um, in that book that there may have been um, maybe a parent that was putting a child into or maybe teaching a child because it says put them in mind to be subject to principalities and power to obey magistrates to be ready for every good work to speak evil of no man to be no bowlers but gentle sowing all meekness unto all men. so it sounds like there is someone training a child in the way they should go um and i encourage us when we get time to read that so we can understand what was going on previously but Alexis Hubbies and Flawless Man, when we are training children or when we're learning ourselves, and those are some things to look forward to, to understand that we have the power over um, the spirits of darkness and uh, we have to learn to obey the power that is over us. So maybe some type of authority, maybe some type of management, um, maybe a parent, um, but to be ready to always do good, to speak good and to be of good, to never talk about people, not being evil of no man, to love all people, to not be ballers, but to be wealthy, to always be gentle, showing meekness unto all men. So it just sounds like the Lord is teaching us to um, have the fruit of the spirit and the person is saying that their testimony how you know they have come a long way just them and the lord raising this child and they've been doing a pretty good job um this person and the lord has been doing excuse me bless me this person and the lord has been doing a good job together with raising the child and they're saying like the child is getting ready to go on because the child is grown now. So they're asking the Lord to help them to be there for their children. Um, they're asking the Lord to be there with their children while they're at the distance that way that um, they're good. And they're asking the Lord to be a companion for the for the children as the Lord is a companion unto them. They're saying, go with this child today. I mustn't follow too closely and I can't yet judge my distance. So I need you to always be with this child and remind me that nothing can separate us from one another or your love. So no matter how old a child is, no matter um, what goes on in a relationship, um, we just have to learn how to respect that distance and not follow too closely, not be trying to um, shape our children to ourselves and have them live the lives that we didn't or we couldn't or that we won't live because we refuse to live those lives. But to let them go, um, to let them live their lives with wisdom, give them the information that they need, and always bless the children as well. Bless the Lord to be a companion to the children as well. So Alexis Love Beauties and Flawless Man, we have been going over a lot of parent content um, in our daily breads, which I absolutely love. I have a few things that I want to talk about as far as like parenting or being a child and different things like that. So we will still get into that later on in this channel. But for now, when you get time, I encourage you to read Titus chapter three, verses one through two. And God bless you. Alexis loves you. Have a fantastic Sunday. If you live in Michigan, you know it's snow because our weather been fooling. So be safe out there on the road today. And I will talk to you soon.